Hi folks, welcome to another Stall13.com video. We're going to talk about safety when you work with a horse. Cross ties are okay. I'm not a big fan of cross ties. That's my personal opinion. I like somebody to actually hold a horse like we're doing here today. We're going to talk about safety. She's going to just pick out her horse's hooves, get ready for a trail ride. But I want to talk about the person holding the horse. We have a couple issues right now. If you look in her hand, go ahead and hold it tight. Look what she's done to the lead rope. She actually has it looped through her hands. If this horse was to get away, what would happen is this rope would just be bound around her hands and this poor girl would be drugged. What you want to do is you want to hold, hold the lead rope close to the snap. You want to take the extra lead rope. You want to coil it back and forth like this so that if it's in your, hold tight. If the horse was to get away or pull, it's literally maybe give her a rope burn, but it's not going to hook her hands. The other thing when you're holding a horse, I'm going to turn you around, you want to position yourself to see what's going on. You want to make sure that you can see this person behind you and that you communicate. The other mistake that people make is they will literally stand right here. They'll stand in front of a horse. You're now trapping one of the horse's number one escapes, which is to go straight ahead. So many people have been bit in the chest. So many people have been run over because they're invading this horse's space and the horse feels trapped. You always want to give the horse as many avenues to side pass and escape as possible. Now sometimes if someone's working on a horse, you may want to rotate. Go ahead and come over here, please. You may want to move to this side of the horse as well so you're on the same side so that you communicate. Now what you've done is, is now everybody's on this side of the horse. That means that the horse, if it wants to bolt, it can go straight. If it wants to back up, it can back up. It's got this whole area to go crazy and nuts. But if you have somebody working on this side, you have somebody standing on this side, you've literally made that horse feel like it's in a set of stocks, that it's trapped, it can't go anywhere. I'm not necessarily talking about what's proper equestrian etiquette. Who cares? We're talking about your safety, what makes your horse comfortable. That's what's important here, folks. So think about this when you're working on a horse. It's a nice social time. It should be fun and it should always be safe. This has been another Stall13.com video. Take care of yourself and your horses.